you throw it to him? These little guys have gone one step beyond simply living in poverty. They're now homeless. We continue to try to struggle to keep up with the need. Keeping up with that need has never been more urgent, as evidenced by new data from the U.S. Census Bureau. According to a just released American Community Survey, 48,000 kids are in poverty in Hamilton County. Include all of greater Cincinnati, and that number soars to more than 95,000. The poverty line for a family of four is an annual income of $24,339 or less. The challenge of poverty is, it's just not one thing. It's the challenge of low wages, lack of affordable housing, um, lack of affordable accessible childcare, transportation challenges. Stacy Burge is head of an organization that helps homeless families find shelter at local religious establishments. Tracy Cook also helps kids impacted by abuse and neglect. I think this entire community has been awakened in the last couple of years that sadly our community um, is one of the leading communities in the nation because of childhood poverty. One of the things that people are really puzzled about is what's the root cause? It's very complex. It's almost like they're overlapping vicious cycles. But both women believe better days are ahead since more people are asking how they can help. What I think is happening is people um, have a better understanding and we're trying to bring the pieces together in a more organized way. Now, I also spoke to former Hamilton County coroner Dr. Odell Owens today. He's been part of a group called the Child Poverty Collaborative. He told me he'd like to see the appointment of a poverty czar whose mission would be to make sure that everyone in our community has a sense of collective will to help children in need. Reporting live, Todd Dykes, WWT News 5. All right.